Hi, in this video, I'd just like to go over setting up your Dead Space 1 with E&B and Sweet Effects. So the first thing you'll want to do is actually go to the mod page and you'll find it here on ModDB. I'll leave a link under the actual video here. So what you want to do when you get here is you just want to go to the download now. And once you've downloaded it, you want to just open that file. Now I'm using WinRAR to open this, although 7-Zip and some other zip programs will work in order to open the file if you have any trouble. Now once the file is open, depending on whether you use Steam or Origin Games, you'll find it in Steam, in C Program File, Steam, Steam Apps Common, and your game folders will be listed there. Now if you happen to be using Origin, which in this case I am, you'll find your games in C Program Files, Origin Games, and then you'll find your games listed there. And you just want to go to that Dead Space folder and open that up. And then you're just going to take the contents from the folder here and drag and drop it over. Now if you're a Windows 10 user, you just want to rename the DXGI DLL to D3D11 and that's basically it. At this point you're all set. Leave the game folder open for the initial startup just in case you do have any startup issues and start the game and make sure that everything is running correctly. Now if you do start the game and you get a blank screen or the graphics look off then just exit the game and go back into the game folder here and then what you want to do this is for troubleshooting you want to open that alt d3d9 folder and you want to select one of the four here and just copy the d3d9 and paste that alternate over top of the existing one start your game again make sure that it's running everything looks all right and you should be all set at that point when you finish your game just close the game folder off and you're good to go now if you choose to alter the effects for the sweet effects you can find it in the sweet effects preset folder right here and you can also alter that with any sweet effects settings file 1.51 and down and it will work as an alternative to this preset although if you do replace the preset then set the new settings file in the preset folder and name it the same as the existing one here and then just name the original one to dead space x or something just alter its name slightly but name the new one dead space so that the preset file will direct it to the proper settings file now one last thing, I'm actually going to add the game EXE to Clean Men. You can also find the setup video for that on my YouTube page. And I normally do this for all my games after I've set them up. And that's basically you just want to copy the game EXE. And if you've gone through the video for Clean Mem setup, you just want to open that clean mem settings wizard and you just want to go through and you want to add that exe to the process list here the only list sorry now my list um, as you can see it's not that long but I have recently reloaded my computer and I am adding them as I go through. Now if you're not sure how to do that process, again just check my YouTube page for the Clean Mem setup video and that will take you through the entire process. So basically the EMB and Sweet Effects is now installed and I've assigned the EXE to the Clean Mem to allow it to run better and the game should be all set. So if there are any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, 
Thanks a lot for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video and take care. I'll talk to you again.